Ha! Hey everyone, Hassan here. Welcome to the world of Ha. Today I have another Apple related review for you. This is the new Apple Watch Sport Loop in product red color. So the Sport Loop has been out for a while. Uh, I have the, um, I was about to say black, but I don't know that it's called black because it is slightly different. I'll actually just take this off uh, my wrist here and, and show you real quick. Um, I mean, it, it is kind of black, uh, but it does have a little bit of a hint of a different color on here, though. So, uh, like in the light, it certainly does. And I know that the new releases of the Sport Loop are reflective. Like, if you, especially in light, it'll really shine and, and be a little bit more reflective. Um, but I actually really like this Apple Watch band. Um, this is one of my newer ones. I have a whole bunch of them. Um, and one of my main go-to ones has been the, well, I actually bought mine with the Milanese Loop, but I've been using this leather loop right here, the Cape Cod Blue uh, leather loop, because I have the Cape Cod Blue uh, case on my iPhone right here. Uh, so it complements it very well. And um, so I certainly do love it, but when I come home from work, like the my go-to watch band so far at home has been this one because it's so comfortable uh so so comfortable and and that's what i love about it you know especially even if i am out doing yard work anything like if i'm sweating this catches the sweat really well so it's very multi-purpose and it looks pretty decent I, I i do like the the look of it as well very easy to use uh with the whole velcro um connection right there very secure it feels like so i really really like this sport loop and i thought Maybe I would get another one in a different color, so that way I can change it up and, and do different things. I actually thought about, because I think they make a blue that complements like a Cape Cod blue or something. I thought about it. Um, and I almost got it, but then I was like, you know what? What if I just did something totally different? Because I have so many blue ones. I have that blue one, and then I have this electric blue uh, Apple Watch band as well. Uh, the like kind of the like leather style right here. I have this more lighter like woven nylon band that's kind of bluish. So I was like, I have so much blue already and, and I love it so much. Why not change it up? Why not do something different? And then just recently, Apple released a product red version of the Apple Watch band. And this is, I believe, the first time that they've released a product red Apple Watch band. So they've done product red like iPhones and everything, and I actually did an unboxing of the iPhone XR product red version for my dad. Uh, he got that one, so I showed you guys that video, and it was really cool. Um, and I thought, you know what? That's, that's kind of cool. They're doing a product red Apple Watch band. And at first I was like, well, was that really gonna match with what I have? I have a Series 3 Apple Watch, and it has a giant red circle on it, so I, the red at least matches, so why not? You know, I, th I thought this was actually the perfect chance for me to try that out. So that's a long-winded way of me saying I, this is what I got and I'm gonna do an unboxing. But here's the back of it right here, Sport Loop, as it says. So this is the 44 millimeter version, which works with the 42 millimeter Series 3 Apple Watch. Um, if you were to get the 40 millimeter version, that would work with the old 38 millimeter version. So FYI on that, they are fully compatible. Um, all right, so let's slide this out here. These are also some of the more affordable watch bands that Apple has. This is the cheapest that they go is um, about $49. And so that is what this one costs versus some of their Apple watch bands can, up, can go up to a few hundred. So uh, here is the inside right here talking about how you attach Apple watch bands and so on. So uh, that's interesting. Oh wait, for a more secure fit during water sports, Reverse the sport loop band. I I didn't know that was a thing, but I guess we'll try that out. I what really? Huh? I'm kind of curious as to what that's supposed to accomplish, but we'll try that out. So here it is right here uh, And I'm happy to say that the pictures online did look slightly pinkish, but I was like, you know what? I don't, I don't think it's actually going to be pink. I mean product red is there's there's product red is product red, you know, like it, it's got to look that, that color. Uh, and so while it does say red sport loop right here, the back does say product red right there. And um, it definitely is red. Um, it's not like a dark red. So I guess you could misconstrue it for like a dark pink kind of, but it certainly looks more red in person than it did in the picture um, uh, online. So 
yeah, it definitely looks pretty cool. I do like the color. So, um, color-wise, does it match? You know, it gets close enough, I think, especially the outside edges. And also, these ones are slightly different shades of the color inside, you know? So, I think it certainly would fit. So, why don't we give it a shot? Let's let's try it out. So, all right. The uh, By the way, so in case you're curious, so the, the black parts right here are the little connectors, um, and then the rest is all red. Okay. And there you go. Let's, uh, I'll just kind of fold it up a little bit. So, oh, that's kind of cool too. So on the inside, it actually says product red right there. So that's a, a neat little touch right there. So let's just fold it over and take a look. Here it is right here. This is the Series 3 Apple Watch. And uh, I think that looks pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, I think that definitely looks really, really nice. The red certainly matches the the red button there. More so because in Series 4, it's just a red line. Although, you know, that would still match. And this is the stainless steel version, um, in case you couldn't tell. Uh, so let's let's put this on. All right, there you go. And then comfort-wise, I mean, it's the same as the sport loop that I had before. Um, so certainly very, very comfortable. I do love that. Um, yes, I have very hairy arms. I know. Thank you to everybody that loves to point that out in the comment section as if I didn't know what my own arms look like. Um, so that's one thing that is especially important to me when I get Apple Watch bands is I want to make sure they don't like catch on the hairs or anything like that. And this, this band, I mean, you can move it around and everything. It's super comfortable. Not once has it caught on the hairs. Um, so very, very comfortable. Um, and, uh, I think this looks pretty cool. I, I, I like this a lot actually. Uh, so if I kind of want something more basic, you know, I have the, the black sports loop. Um, but if I ever want to, you know, have something a little more fun and flashy and kind of change it up from the normal black, then I have the, the product red right here. So, um, I like it. Yeah. I think it looks, looks pretty cool. Uh, let me know in the comment section below what you all think of this Apple watch band as well. Um, especially with the, the red button. How does that fit? Uh, so now I'm kind of curious as to what this was saying about for a more secure fit during water sports, reverse the sport loop band. So what in the world is this talking about? Because I am confused here. So, okay. So this is how I had it connected before, right? So, um, what is this saying? Okay. The... trying to like follow the packaging instructions and see what it's what it's talking about um so this used to go on top here so this is saying do it this way okay so let's try it this way with the 44 millimeter upside down so yeah the, instead of this side connecting at the bottom the other side is that so that's supposed to have a more secure fit during water sports I, I don't I don't know why that is, why why that would be more secure versus the other way. Is there any reason? Do you guys know? Um, I'm kind of curious. I you know you could do it either way. I suppose it is reversible, right? So you could decide if you like this way better or not. Um, I prefer the other way because then the little this clip is focusing the opposite direction. Maybe it's because this can uh, hit on something. Like I mean, not that it would, but like let's say I'm I'm wearing it. You know the the. The normal way, like this. Oh no, actually no, because the loop is down. No, yeah, it goes like this, right. So if this is the normal way, then I suppose the loop is like this, so it could like catch on something and pull off, maybe, versus here, since it's inside towards your body, it's less likely to catch on something. Although I feel like this is more likely to catch on something. I don't know, I, I don't do water sports, so I am the, <laughs> I don't really do sports in general, to be honest. So I am the last person to ask about that, but I just thought that was kind of curious how the instructions pointed that out, and I was like, what, really? I don't know, seemed uh, seemed very interesting. So anyways, uh, that is it, guys. That is the, the new Product Red version 
of the sport loop. Everything else about the sport loop is the same. Um, you know what to expect. So super duper comfortable, super good. If you, uh, this is the most comfortable Apple Watch band. Um, I have, I mean, I've tried all the different, like almost all the different kinds of Apple Watch bands. Um, as you can see, I mean, I have like all of them. <laughs> so, I mean, I had from the sports band, which is one of my least favorite, not one of, this is my least favorite band. It is the least comfortable one, the sports band. It's, even, it's also gets all dirty and all messed up. Um, so I do not recommend that. Woven nylon is pretty comfortable. So it's pretty decent, um, but it's not like a soft material. Um, you know, the this is leather. So it's leather. Same with leather loop is going to have that leather feel to it. Uh, the Milanese loop is certainly nice. And so is the... Um, the link bracelet, but again, these are not meant for comfort. These guys, very comfortable. Uh, they do absorb sweat pretty nicely, so if you're, you know, working out with these things, they are very versatile and they look pretty nice, definitely. So, um, from from all accounts, I, I highly recommend these ones. I, I certainly think if if you're going with any Apple Watch band, um, if there's only one that you would have to pick. I always default to Milanese Loop because I feel like this fits in all different settings and it is comfortable. But if you have two Apple Watch bands to pick, Milanese Loop is a classic. Looks very, very nice and, and slick and professional. Uh, and then the Sports Loop for something more casual. That's what I would recommend. But let me know in the comment section below what you think is uh, as well of this, this new product, Red Sports Loop. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you later.